Raise Kundalini by activating each chakra one at a time using a specific type of energetic awareness. This can easily be learned by starting with a simple exercise. First, hold one hand out in front of yourself with the palm facing up, palm flat. Then, use your other hand to lightly trace a circle on the palm of the open hand. Close your eyes and do this a few times, paying attention to how it feels. After about 30 seconds, stop tracing. Keep your palm out and your eyes closed. Concentrate on the sensation left over from the stimulation of tracing the circle. This is the energetic awareness needed to activate chakras and raise kundalini energy. Now that we have a feel for that, let's activate our first chakra, the base chakra. Begin by sitting or laying down and imagine that you are tracing circles on the bottom of your feet and remember the sensation that we felt when we were tracing a circle on our palm. This energetic awareness starts out as imagination or thought and then turns into a very real feeling. Ponder the notion that energy flows where attention goes. Once you feel an energetic sensation in your feet, then you are ready. Now, with your eyes closed, imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each of your feet. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, pull these energy balls up the legs, like pulling a sponge through a tube. Moving energy up the legs, up into your hips, and coming together, converging upon your base chakra, located at the perineum. Sweep energy up the legs several times by forming a fresh energy ball on each foot and moving them up the legs, depositing at your base chakra. Now that the base chakra is charged with energy, it's time to activate it. Place your energetic awareness on the base chakra, a red, fist-sized ball of energy located near the base of your spine at the perineum. Move this ball in and out of your body a few inches, back and forth for a few seconds. Then, imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on the perineum. First clockwise, then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart like a small loaf of bread. Tear the ball apart from different angles again and again. Now feel the energy ball growing in size. And then feel it shrinking down to a very small ball of energy. Then feel it growing big like a soccer ball. And then shrinking again. And then growing. And then shrinking. Finally, feel the red ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog or a mist and then the red fog condenses down to a tight little marble-sized ball of energy. 
your base chakra is now activated. In order to raise Kundalini, we need to repeat this process for all seven chakras, activating each one, one at a time, raising energy up from the feet as we go. So moving on, let's form a ball of energy around each foot so that we can charge the next chakra. Imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Then just like we did before, pull these energy balls up the legs like pulling a sponge through a tube. Moving energy up the legs, up into your hips, and coming together, converging on the sacral chakra located in the pelvic area. Sweep energy up the legs several times by forming a fresh energy ball on each foot and moving them up the legs, depositing at your sacral chakra. Now that the sacral chakra is charged with energy, let's activate it as well. Place your energetic awareness on your sacral chakra, an orange, grapefruit-sized ball of energy located in the pelvic area. Move this energy ball in and out of your body a few inches, back and forth, for a few seconds. Then, imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on the pelvic area. First clockwise, then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart like a small loaf of bread. Tear the ball apart from different angles again and again. Now feel the energy ball growing in size, and then feel it shrinking down to a very small ball of energy. Then feel it growing big again, like a soccer ball. And now feel it shrinking again. Now the ball grows in size once more. and then feel it shrinking down once more. Finally, feel the orange ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog or a mist. And then the orange fog condenses down to a tight little marble-sized ball of energy. Your sacral chakra is now activated. Let's keep it going and move on to the next chakra, the solar plexus chakra, located between the navel and solar plexus. Once more, imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, Pull these energy balls up the legs, like pulling a sponge through a tube. Moving energy up the legs, up into your hips, and coming together, converging upon your solar plexus chakra. Sweep energy up the legs several times by forming a fresh energy ball on each foot, and moving them up the legs, depositing at your solar plexus chakra. A yellow energy ball located between the navel and solar plexus.
Now that the solar plexus chakra is charged with energy, it's time to activate it as well. Place your energetic awareness on the solar plexus chakra. Move this yellow ball of energy in and out of your body a few inches, back and forth for a few seconds. Then imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on the area of the solar plexus chakra, first clockwise and then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart like a small loaf of bread. Tear the ball apart from different angles again and again. Next, feel the energy ball growing in size. and then feel it shrinking down to a very small ball of energy. Then feel it growing again, big like a soccer ball. And then feel it shrinking again. And then growing and shrinking down. Finally, Feel the yellow ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog or a mist. And then the yellow fog condenses down into a tight little marble sized ball of energy. Your solar plexus chakra is now activated. Next we will move energy up to the heart chakra, located in the center of the chest. Again, we will start by imagining and feeling a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, pull these energy balls up the legs like we did before. Moving energy up into your hips and coming together, converging upon your heart chakra in the center of the chest. Pull these energy balls up the legs like we did before. Moving energy up into your hips and coming together, converging upon your heart chakra in the center of the chest. Place your energetic awareness on the area of the heart chakra, a green fist sized ball of energy. Move this ball in and out of your body a few inches, back and forth for a few seconds. Then imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on the center of your chest, first clockwise and then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart. Tear the ball apart from different angles again and again. Now feel the energy ball growing in size. And now feel it shrinking down to a very small ball of energy. Then feel it growing big. And then feel it shrinking again. Then feel it growing in size. And then shrinking down. Finally, feel the green ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog or a mist. 
Then the green fog condenses down into a tight little marble-sized ball of energy. Your heart chakra is now activated. Next we move up to the throat chakra. A small blue chakra located in the throat. With your eyes still closed, imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, pull these energy balls up the legs. Moving energy up into your hips, up through your abdomen, up through the chest and coming together, converging upon your throat chakra. Sweep energy up the legs several times by forming a fresh ball of energy on each foot and moving them up the legs through your body depositing at your throat chakra. Now that we've deposited energy on the throat chakra, we can activate it. Place your energetic awareness on the throat chakra, a small blue ball of energy located at the area of the throat. Move this ball in and out of your body a few inches, back and forth for a few seconds. Then imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on your throat. First clockwise, then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart. Tear the small ball apart from different angles again and again. Next, feel the energy ball growing in size, and then feel it shrinking down again. Then feel it growing larger, and then shrinking again, and then growing larger, and then shrinking down one more time. Finally, feel the blue ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog. And then the blue fog condenses down into a tight little marble-sized ball of energy. Your throat chakra has now been activated. Now we will activate the third eye chakra, located in the center of the brow. Just like before, Imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, pull these energy balls up the legs like pulling a sponge through a tube. Moving energy up the legs, up into your hips, up through your midsection, through the chest, past your throat, and coming together, converging upon your third eye chakra. A small indigo ball of energy located in the center of the brow. Place your energetic awareness on the third eye chakra and move this ball of energy in and out of your body a few inches back and forth for a few seconds. Mm -hmm. 
Then imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on your third eye chakra. First clockwise, then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart. Tear the ball apart from different angles again and again. Now feel the energy ball growing in size. And then feel it shrinking down to a very small ball of energy. Then feel it growing larger, perhaps to the size of a grapefruit. And then feel it shrinking again. And growing once more to a larger size. And then shrinking down once more. Finally, feel the indigo ball of energy dissipate and spread like a fog or a mist. And then the indigo fog condenses down into a tight little marble sized ball of energy. Your third eye chakra has now been activated. Finally, we can activate the crown chakra, a violet energy center located near the crown of the head. One last time, imagine and feel a blue energy ball forming around each foot. Breathe and concentrate on these balls of energy until you can feel them with your feet. Next, pull these energy balls up the legs, moving energy up the legs, up into your hips, up through the heart chakra, up through your throat, past the third eye, and converging upon your crown chakra, a large violet chakra located on the top of the head. Place your energetic awareness on the crown chakra located on the top of your head. Move this ball in and out of your body a few inches back and forth for a few seconds. Then imagine and feel that you are tracing a spiral on the top of your head. First clockwise, then counterclockwise. After that, imagine that you are using your hands to tear the ball apart. Tear the ball into pieces from different angles again and again. Now feel the energy ball growing to a great size. And then feel it shrinking down. Now feel it growing large again, expanding. And then feel it shrinking. Feel it growing large once more. And then feel the ball of energy shrinking down. Finally, feel the violet ball of energy dissipate and spread like a large fog at the top of your head. And then the violet colored fog condenses down into a tight little ball of energy on the top of the head. Your crown chakra has now been activated and you have now raised kundalini energy starting from the feet all the way to the top of your head. Repeat this exercise as often as you'd like. The more you try it, the better you'll get.